Imagine this daily routine. You walk through the mailbox, you open the door, and you look inside for something good. Maybe a card from someone you care about, maybe money, maybe a note from Ed McMahon saying, you've won the Publishers Clearinghouse sweepstakes. I'm not even sure if he's still alive though. What you pull out instead is junk mail, advertisements, bills. Ugh, bills. Having to pay bills is never fun, but once a month or once a year, you get that bill you really hate to pay. I mean, really hate to pay. You put off paying it till the last possible minute and begrudgingly you write that check. Welcome to episode number 17 of the Life Writers Blog, where you can find inspiration and useful tips to help you write your life stories. I'm Patricia Chapontier, and I am very glad you decided to join us. Today is the second Thursday of the month, and what we always do on the second Thursday is write in response to a prompt. I started off this episode talking about bills. And that's what we're going to write about today. Bills you most hate to pay. Until I turned 65 and got onto Medicare, health insurance was the bill I most hated to pay. I had a $10,000 deductible and it cost me hundreds and hundreds of dollars every month. I had to be half dead before the insurance would do me any good whatsoever. And it made me mad every time I had to write that check. But I had been in a catastrophic accident before and I knew I had to have insurance. I just hated paying for it. Maybe your dreaded bill is from the IRS or some other company. Maybe it was a one-time bill that added insult to injury, like still having to pay a car note after your car was totaled. As many of you know, I am a big fan of making lists as a way of brainstorming before you actually start writing the story. That's what we're going to do today. Before you start writing sentences and paragraphs, we're going to just make a list. It takes the pressure off of having to write something that's good. It's just a list. There's no performance anxiety whatsoever. Plus, it's a really great way to generate a lot of story ideas for what you might write in the future. Just write one, two, three words to help you remember what you were thinking about. Don't write complete sentences, make a list and write as quickly as possible. Don't stop and think too much. Keep the pen moving and don't judge what comes to you. Just write it on the page, even though it seems like it doesn't make any sense whatsoever. I'm going to set a clock for three minutes and I want you to start brainstorming bills that you hate to pay. I'll let you know when time's up.
Okay, how was that? Did you come up with some ideas about bills you hate to pay? Pick one of the items from your list now and write about the one or more bills you hate to pay. And know that the only way to do this wrong is not to do it at all. We would love to read what you came up with. If you care to share your story with us, you can upload a Microsoft Word or Adobe PDF document in the comments section down below and let us commiserate with you after having to pay this terrible, terrible bill. So until next time, everyone, happy writing. If you enjoyed this week's episode, you will love our Life Writers membership. Whether you don't know where to start writing your life stories, have started and stopped many times, or have been writing but want to receive feedback to make your stories better, the Life Writers membership is where you need to be. We have a Get Started Roadmap, an extensive library of instructional videos, live events via Zoom, and a supportive and active community. If you want to take the stories that live in your heart and mind and put them onto the page, check out Life Writers at lifewriters.us.